Hello YouTube, it's Kindred here. Hereby, I present to you the shortest guide you'll ever see for Ultra Turn for CTR and F. Direct to the point, let's get into it. So, in order to pull off that technique, you will need to hold the following buttons. The break button, shown on the screen, the reverse button, and the left or right button, depending on where you need to do a sharp turn. Along with these buttons, you will need to press jump. Press by the way, not hold. Press jump depending on how sharp your turn would be. If it's just going to be a quick turn, then just press it once. But if you need to do a really sharp turn, like in Turbo Track or Dragon Mines, you may need it to press. You may need to press multiple times. Also, take note, take note of this. I can't stress enough how important it is to hold the reverse button. Think of it like this. The brake button is used to help your cart steer more, while the reverse button also does that, and it helps maintain whatever fire you currently have. Blue fire, sacred fire, or just boost fire. Okay? So, let's get into practical application. Spiral coming! Did you see that? Okay. Before I end the video, always remember to not let go of the reverse button because the moment you let go of it, you lose all your fire, okay? Furthermore, I would like to point out that this technique is not solely limited to be used in Dragon Mines and Turbo Track. In fact, if you are using speed driving style, if you want and if you want to cut corners, hug walls to save more time, especially when you are attempting world records in time trial. You will find yourself using this technique more often. If you like this video, please do subscribe. And if you have any comments, please let me know. Thank you for watching.